Hey everybody, Mom and Son Train Rail fans coming to you on Wednesday. Um, wanted to do a quick video. My nine trees are complete and they are dry and I think I did a pretty good job on them. Um, they look good, they're holding together. But yep, I got none of them. So I'll work on some more, probably this coming up weekend, and we'll see how they go. Let me move this out of the way and not drop it. I typically do not do a product review, but I got some of this Aqua Magic. Um, I used some of it yesterday, and you guys know that I love to do water scenes. Um, I'm not real thrilled with this stuff. Now, it does make it simple for people who do not like to do the two-part resin. Um, I like the two-part resin. This stuff is already pre-mixed. You don't have to do a thing but pour it in. Um, there's no mixing, no odor. It, it, it is highly reflective. I will give them that. Um, but it takes forever to dry. I used a very thin coat of this yesterday, and it is still not dry. Where if I were to do the same thing with my two-part two resin, it would have already been dry. Now, it also states that, you know, it's easy to create waves and, you know, ripple effects and all that stuff. It's not. Um, and I don't know if it's not the right consistency or they expect you to do very, very small water scenes and after multiple layers and multiple days of taking it to dry, like I said, that little bit that I did today, um, and well, I did it yesterday, but came out today, and it still wasn't dry. Um, it would be pretty hard to do some rippling effects in it. It's still not even tacky enough to make the waves. You know, other people might like it. This is just my personal opinion, and that's kind of why I don't like doing um, product. I guess you would call it just, you know, my opinions. But it's for the amount of money you spend on this thing. I think it was like $27. Um, I can get a whole lot more out of a two-part resin kit. Um, and it works a lot better for me. So, some of you might like it. Some of you might, you know, feel that it's great because you don't have to mix. Um, I prefer doing it the two-part. But I just wanted to let everybody know that I did try it. And I'm just not a really big fan of it. Um, and for the amount of money, I just, I really felt that I needed to make people aware that you're going to spend a, a good little bit of money on this product and you might be thinking that okay it's like a two-part and I don't have to mix it all up or anything like that and no you don't um, but <laughs> I hope you have time and patience and it gives you what you need but that's just like I said my opinion could do a it could be great for somebody else. The company could be awesome. This is the first time I've dealt with it. But after using it, I kind of wish I could return it um, and get my two-part resin. But other than that, guys, we are just going to be working on some mo more foam figures. I'm going to be working on some more trees. Um, start lining up some foam that... 
I did make around the base of Ray's gigantic mountain um, and I decided to do foam pieces for the first layer to go around it and then I will use some um, of the corrugated water pipe and that's what will hold the O scale trap and then I can start putting foam layers and plaster and everything like that to build up the mountain and the shelves coming off for the scenery work. So there's a lot to do, um, 3D printing, a lot of stuff. So, you know, Ray will be out later this afternoon and, you know, I promise I will get a video out with him today, but he wanted to do a short video this morning with his uh, pictures that we took with his best buddy, Pat, um, I put his link in that short video. He's just a super, super great guy. And um, he's just never wavered on the friendship he had with Ray. So I appreciate him a lot. But I hope everybody has a good Wednesday. And we'll catch up with you guys later.